CIPLA, the manufacturer of pharmaceuticals, in particular antiretroviral drugs, says it is banking on global fund business in order for it to regain its revenue growth trajectory. We did $2 million for whole year. In the first six months of this year, we've done $6.7 million. Okay, so $7 million. That's why you see we are saying there is a rebound of the global fund business. Officials of CIPLA who were sharing highlights of their business operations also stated that the current loss of 14.5 billion shillings compared to a profit of 3.3 billion in the previous period will be mitigated. With IPO costs and uh, you know, commissions, uh, say a commission on sales being a savings on that front. They also say that for now, the board has decided not to pay an interim dividend in order to invest further into the struggling business. None of these orders that we have received or we received from the <coughs> President's Malaria Initiative, I will call it PMI, was invoiced in the first six months. They started to be invoiced actually in September, uh, in October and November, which will fall into our second half. So that PMI business will be new growth. Reina Ojun, NTV Business.